so we're back in this explosion of fire. In the village of the hidden room. Yes. Did you see that, Chief? While you were in denial, Uber got bored. Uber. Give me the rune, or this village will be charred beyond recognition. Uber. Damn you! Are you that eager to see the cursed power of the Soul Eater? Oh, Soul Eater, cursed rune, show your power and strike the enemy. Strike her. Strike her now. Ooh. We destroyed ourselves. All right. Sweet. Travelers, I'm sorry to have involved you in this business. Wait, we're behind the fireplace? Yeah, we're in the secret hidden room. I guess so. No in kidding! Village. <laughs> Ted, come here. Yes, Grandpa. Give me a right hand. That's right. Stay still, Ted. Oh, Soul Eater, rune of life and death, depart my body and give this boy your power. Wow, he's got really long reach if he can reach his right hand from across the room. Oh, so we get to witness uh, Ted getting the uh, Soul Eater. So if we're watching Ted get it for the first time, how many years in the past is this? Well, I mean, Ted's only a boy there, and he wasn't that much older when we saw him, so surely it's like ten years ago or so. And Wendy can't be that old, you know? <laughs> and Necklord. And, well, vampires don't live very long either. <laughs> Especially runic ones. Yeah, sure. Good Grandpa, what's this? Forgive me, Ted. I'm afraid I've passed on a sorrowful fate unto you. Remember that the power of the rune must never be unleashed. Like you just did? <laughs> Travelers, up ahead is a secret path which leads to the village's outskirts. Take Ted, this child, and run. I will get Wendy's attention and act as a decoy. So I guess Ted learned that maneuver from his grandpa. Apparently so. Whoosh. Let's go, Ted. Okay. Grandpa, you'll come back later. That's right, you must hurry now. We've got Tiny Ted. Tiny Ooh. Ted. Let's go back. Um, whoa. That fire must have burned down the place. In three seconds. Well, in the fireplace. I mean, nobody was there to watch it. So remember that, uh, the ancestor of the... <laughs> oh, the predecessor of the, uh, village chief of the elves? <laughs> yeah. Let's go raid her stuff now that she's not there. Ooh, what? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot this one was in there. We just bought one of those for 200,000 bits. That's okay. <laughs> I don't really care. Now we can have two, even though you only ever need one. I have two champions crystals. <laughs> sell it at least? I don't know. I'll sell it on eBay. Is there a market for those? Whoa, what the heck is that? Oh. Lady Windy sure is a warrior. Instead of beating around the bush, why don't we just burn this village? I just follow my orders and stand on guard. And look who's coming! Just a child and some cowards. What did you say? Keep your distance from him, Victor. This one's tough. Yeah, I'm going with Cleo on this. Yes, I know. He's not human. Even at this distance, I can feel his terrible power. So, you understand my power, do you? Well then, don't bother to struggle against my sword. I'll chop you all into little pieces, making sure you feel no pain. Damn. Oh. Snagalore. Hey, Uber. Lady Windy wants you. That old man escaped into the forest. Neck Lord! You again? I'm very busy right now. I'll take you on some other time. It looks like we're safe. Yes, and the fire in the village is dying down too. But I don't know what happened to the villagers. What happened to Grandpa? Ted, I'm afraid you're going to have to depend on yourself from now on. Do you understand? Master Smappy, this boy is definitely the Ted we knew. We must be in the past. No, duh. The past? 
The Star Dragon Swords curse threw us back into the past. Wait, he knew what the sword's name was? I was about to say the exact same thing. <laughs> Yay for lack of continuity. Probably. What just happened was the incident from 300 years ago that Ted mentioned. And from this moment on, Ted must journey alone for 300 years. In any case, we must find a way to return, return to the present. You're right. Hey, Smappy! What's that light? <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't... Uh, isn't that where we first came out? Okay. I Sorry, agree, I let's go back out. to that place by running in the total opposite direction. <laughs> I've always hated this village, because I feel like I have to go back all the time. Yeah, they kind of do keep forcibly taking you to different points in the village. Yeah, see, now I gotta come all the way back to get this. A boar crystal. Ooh. Make lots of noises with my controller. Do a little right. dance. Now we have successfully looted the uh, village of the hidden room. Maybe if we enter there, we can return to the present. Could be. That's a pretty good idea coming from you. Oh, leave me alone. Snappy, what shall we do with the kid? We'll take him along. I want a tiny Ted. But we don't know if that's the right thing to do, so... Let's get going, Snappy, while this light is still shining. I suppose we are in the cave of the past, so maybe it makes sense that we came back here. Boy, were we lucky. I guess we made it back. Ted's gone. You're right. He probably belongs on the other side and was unable to cross over. From now on, he's on his own, and his destiny cannot be altered. Yep, that's about right. Sorry, Tiny Ted. This thing again? Stay clear of it, everyone. We don't want to go through that again. Listen to Mr. Expert. You got us into that mess into the first place. Victor. I... I... D didn't do anything. Victor. Don't you have an important mission? That's right. I'm going to kill that necklord. I was just getting tired of sleeping. I'll join you on your mission. Pull me out. What's with this thing? Pretty arrogant for a sword. If you don't want to, fine. But you'll never defeat the vampire. Okay, okay. Okay? I mean, yes, sir. Let's go, partner. Why should a sword call me partner? Um... I can't, do you remember how much they talk about the sword? Are we going to talk about it, it more later, or should I talk about I, it now? Um, uh, I don't remember how much they talk about it. Why don't we wait and see for a bit? Okay. How much time do we have? About a minute twenty. I'm just going to use the escape talisman. I'm lazy. Oh, no! Lazy. <laughs> Not that far. Not that lazy. <laughs> I need to go back and uh, get the librarian. Ah, yes, now that we have the war scroll. From the treasure trolls. That's it! That's the war scroll I was looking for! Thank God it's been found! I must repay you with something! Let me see, are you the Liberation Army? I see... Okay, I've decided. I'll join up! I'm Hugo the Librarian! How does it really go with the, the song, Marion the Librarian? I'm like uh -huh. trying to sit here, I'm like singing in my head, I'm like, nah, I just can't fit in Hugo in there. So, Anyways. do those doors ever get unlocked? No, they're just random stupid doors. Okay, fair enough. Um, I guess this is a good place to stop. I know we're not the full 10 minutes, but um... I really want to get rid of all these old books that we're carrying around as well. <laughs> so I'm probably gonna clear out people's bags and then we're gonna go back to the Warrior's Village in the uh, next video. We're not gonna do a recruiting run? Oh, I guess we can do a recruiting run. So we'll do something. I something. Promise. Yes, something.